Hello again, this is Bill St. George. Welcome to another impression of the show. You can read the cue card. <laughs> Bill St. Yeah, okay. Anyway, uh, welcome back. We're going to, Key and I are going to be doing a show here. Now, if you kind of pull that around and look at that sky. Right, right there. I just used a shotgun. Whoops. Alright, here we go. Uh, come on around to you and show, show the folks back home what we're doing. I've been working on this thing since the start of spring, actually. This with these pear trees here. Um, I mean, they're still there, but they're green now. What I wanted to do is get out here because the sky is so dead. I wanted to find this guy that's really alive, and that one there looks pretty good. These are having to paint pretty fast. And, uh, so, hopefully it can hear me. I don't know. Q is going to have to hang in pretty tight, especially when I turn away from you. So, what I'll do is I'll just paint, and then I'll turn towards the camera and talk, okay? Because I don't know if you can... Does it register when I walk away? Yeah? No? No, okay. Alrighty, so let's see. I'm going to throw this in as fast as I can. Maybe get some... Oh. There's not enough sky in there, but... Oh. Not enough sky, but what the heck. See what we got. See what we got. <laughs> we used the, the uh, handheld mic the last show and it, it just didn't make it. I'm going to go a little darker and just throw a little green in there. Maybe a little bit of yellow. A little blue. And then go in. I, know, I just want to get some more life going in this sky than what's there now. And then what I want to do is put some people in. More people. This is kind of flat in this area, so let's we'll see what we can do there. Nature moves. I mean, the sky moves so fast. I'm paying for plenty air. It's not the easiest way to go. I'm going to just get some, some movement there, a little design in that area up in the sky. I think we'll have something going. Just got back from painting up in a gunk with a couple days ago and it was beautiful up there. I thought perhaps I could finish this up in the studio, but you know I found out like, when we did the last show, uh, Keo and I, over in the Arlington Street Church, uh, that was about my fourth time out there. See if I can I'll get a little, little purple in here. That'll work pretty well with the uh, maybe hey, everything's moving now. It's uh, natural phenomenon, but nonetheless, we're going to try to uh, try to keep up with it as much as possible. You know. I guess if you can hang in there, deal with me. Try to try to get as much of this. There's a nice little lick there. Well, just have to use the paint without the uh, without the liquid, I guess. And see how much I can of this I can capture. That's streaking through there. I don't know. Let's see. It's been an interesting day. It's supposed to uh, supposed to get some relief from this, from this horrible heat wave we've been we're experiencing for the past. Seen it and it's great. Let me 
maybe she has. There was some beautiful light down on the bottom here too. Now, was uh, this part here? Uh, after the movement. Okay. Definitely need the sun back out here. Starting to rain. Yes. Oh. Cutting the show short. <laughs> now we'll go with it. We'll go right to the rain. You know? Let's get the windshield wipers out. A lot of clouds, that's for sure. We probably should have come out of here a little a little earlier, but I came out to mail something I saw the I saw the sky and it was really magnificent. I said, hey, that's really what I need for this painting, some some animation.